Like the title says, I got the wigwag landing lights working. But, well, there was a problem at the very end, and you'll see. Thanks for watching. Appreciate it. Okay, welcome back to the hangar. I'm going to finish the landing lights today. Um, and um, it's been a week since I was here last time, and uh, gave you that little, little walk around. Um, I had to make some decisions. Oh, hang on. Rotten camera work, there we go. I had to make some decisions as to um, how I'm going to connect these wires over here. Well, I was going to use this. Great connectors, O-ring seals, that kind of stuff. The problem is, in order to make it work, it would have to be just long enough that they'd hang down here and dangle. And I don't want that. No, I don't want that at all. So, I've decided to change my mind. And I'm just going to use these l small connectors oops, over here. Simple two-pin connectors. My thinking is, they don't need to be waterproof. They're, they're water-resistant enough in those connectors, but they don't need to be because they're not being submersed. Um, those connectors, these ones here, uh, I mean, if water does get on them, it, it'll shed off. It, it won't short out and... Uh, yeah, I, I'm, I'm going to go with these for now and because uh, they're small and allow me to keep that connection tight up high, not, you know, a big dangly bit down, uh, mm -hmm. down there. So that's the, uh, that's the idea. So I'm going to... Um, make the connections here first and then I'm going to go and mount the landing light on the other wing strut and uh, I only got about two hours today to work here and uh, well, what time is it now? It's 2.30 I gotta be out of here by 4 o'clock so I'm going to have an hour and a half oops, bad camera work only got about an hour and a half. Let's see how much I can get done in an hour and a half. And um, whether I get it finished or not, I'll post it. And, and, and we'll take it from there. So uh, thanks for following along. Appreciate it. And, um, and make sure to go down there. Down there. And there's a subscribe thing. We'll click on that. Click on the bell. And leave a comment. Say hello from somewhere in the world, wherever you are. And um, hopefully... Um, you get something out of this. So, pitter patter, let's get at her. What follows is a brief construction montage. Don't know if you guys can see what I'm doing here, but well, not in camera angle. Unless I can get this camera up higher. Ooh, I even have the tripod. Let me switch tripods. All right, I think that's better. Here, a little higher up. Sure. Tripod is extended all the way. It looks like it is. All right, good. Hopefully, you can see what I'm doing. There we go. And one plug and the other. Of course the negative I put on the flat side and this side here has a little peak so it's positive. Flat side is negative, positive on the peak so polarity matters. Definitely does. Okay, um, I'm going to put the heat shrink tubing on this in a few minutes, and then we'll, uh, we'll see what happens.
you know, the other day I was joking around with some, some uh, people. There's this older woman there and what have you. We were telling, you know, kind of jokes. And I said, you know, and I somehow it got on to the kids nowadays how they dress like strippers. And I said, you know, I thought about taking up stripping for, for a side job. She says, but it'd be the opposite. They'd pay me to put my clothes on. <laughs> I'd be rich. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> We hope you enjoyed this brief construction montage. Okay, I'm going to turn the lights on, landing lights, and we'll see what they look like. You seen it here first? Hey, I'm going to turn the landing lights on, and uh, we'll see what it looks like. Actually, I can go a little closer. Actually, I'm going to turn the lights off in the hangar. Make it look real. Yeah. yeah. Is you okay with that for a minute or two? Over. I know you can't see me on uh, on there in, in the video world, but I'm going to turn the lights on. Let's get this show on the road. All right. Master switch on. There we go. Okay. Wind light is turned on. Let's see how that looks. I'm going to shorten this airspeed. And that is where something went wrong. Well, I'll explain what went wrong um, in the part two of this video. So come back next week and you'll see what I'm talking about with the wigwag. And by the way, the part two of the video is where I uh, restart the engine and. Um, uh, get that engine fogging system working. So, um, yeah, thanks for watching, and uh, hope you enjoyed this brief update, and uh, we shall see you again here in the hangar. Bye-bye for now.